Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel with another YouTube video. This is Kirsten Zavaya. And this is Kiwi Zartler. In today's video, we are going to be trying fufu and an African food called egushi soup. It's supposed to be eaten with your hands. And so this is going to be a really new experience for us because yeah. we've never tried African food. A very new experience because I think I messed up. Um, <laughs> I thought it was lamb. But, but she really ordered goat and she was goat. confusing the goat and the lamb. Yeah, so, so I've never eaten goat. So <laughs> We'll see. And I got beef. So mine is beef agushi soup. And then we've got our fufu. So we dip our fufu inside the soup and eat it with our hands. Yes. So it's so, going to be pretty cool. So, yes. Also... Keely, what was the place where you ordered from? I ordered it from Fusion Vibe. So this is how the food looks. Okay, guys, we're gonna try it now. Okay, we're gonna try. Yeah, this is dope. So we're gonna pull some of the fufu off. And I'm gonna dip it in the gushi soup. This is one of the most different things I've ever tried. I'll say that. Because the soup <laughs> is like very it. different spices. Okay, I'm dipping the like foo in it. It's very different. It's kind of like a salty curry. It's just it's really all weird. With this thing. I don't know, it's so strange that I can't really say if it's good or not. It's weird. It has weird type of spices to it. I don't know what to think. I wanna think it's- I don't it's know if I don't like this, the fufu. The fufu has no flavor, absolutely no flavor to it. it you know, it's mushy, it's like Play-Doh. It's like clay, but f edible clay. A gushi soup itself is like really a uh, Caribbean. I don't know how else to explain it. I think Kiwi liked it more than I did. It's like I'm waiting for an Indian curry taste, but I'm not getting that. So you're not eating. <laughs> we were craving this for the longest. <laughs> we're craving this, and I don't know what to think about it. It's yeah. I think it totally went wrong. Our experience went totally wrong. I think so. I think that. It's not what we expected Expected. it to be. Mm -hmm. I thought it was going to be like a yummy, dippy curry, like kind of like the Indian food we get. Sag paneer, shai paneer, and it's mm -hmm. going to be kind of like that. Because it looks like that. It looks like that. But you try it, and it's just kind of... Weird. Maybe it needs heating, but I don't know. With the meat, it's just... It has no flavor. I don't like this. This is what I don't like. You like this? I don't like this. I don't like... This makes it better. You really? You like this? I think gobble it is weird. That, yeah. It's, it doesn't really make me want to gobble it, that's for sure. I'm sorry, but I'm going to have to rate it like a 3. Yeah, me too. I'm going to rate it a 3 out of 10, too. I don't want to finish it. Me either. I think I'm throwing it away. I'm giving it to my dog. <laughs> <laughs> Believe me, we'd eat anything. Me and Kirsten would eat <laughs> Yeah, anything. that's the thing. So, so the fact that like this didn't and i even saw videos about this and i'm like oh because i saw this girl like stretch it out and i was like oh my god it looked really good on the videos everybody was just yummy maybe we need a different like soup i don't know i'm gonna put salt on this like what if salt makes this better like, if you're like my culture like Honduran or whatever you know what you guys they mix it in it or whatever and then they make it jelly this is what this is supposed to be but it has no flavor yeah it has no flavor but it's just like um, this doesn't have any flavor, the meat doesn't have any flavor, but the only thing that has flavor is the the soup part, but it's just weird flavor. It's like a jerk flavor. I don't like jerk flavor. I feel like there's nothing that I could do to make it better. You know, this whole experience went wrong for us because we tried to- I don't like the whole salt, and I was like, I hope this makes it better. So, well, this whole kind of experience went wrong for us, but the thing is, Yesterday, we tried to go and get it, and we were craving it so bad, you know, and you know, all the restaurants are closed, you know, due to COVID or whatever, and so uh, they close early, and so we went and tried to pick it up, but then the guy's like, I'm sorry, we stopped taking orders at 10, and 
15 minutes ago, you know, and we're like, yeah, we're, we're fine, but they close an hour later, which I thought was pretty weird. We called like so many other places and, and then the other place ran out of food. Usually that never happens to me. I like everything, you know, but this, I'm I just speechless. didn't. <clears throat> I think the meat's the best for me, and I thought I was going to eat it. That's how beef is supposed to be, right? Yeah, have some Let beef. Think. No, mine is beef, but I just don't like it. It's just a, it's too much overwhelming amount of spice. The spice is like left in my mouth. Mouth, exactly. Yeah, and that's what I don't like. I don't like that. It's like I can taste the African. <laughs> not in a bad way. It's so bad. It's bad. Devonda's like, oh, I'm not trying this. I know. Devonda's like, hell no. I'm so fucking low. And I threw meat over there at the party because I was like, I'm not gonna eat this. I'm gonna go eat the food, so that's gonna be. Oh, I know. And my parents, they got barbecue, and I was like, I'm not gonna eat that. I'm gonna have this. And then I have two bites, and I call it quits. Yeah, no. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, this video don't forget to hit the like button and the subscribe button our social media will be in the links down below i hope to see you guys next week thank for you for the next video yes there you go <laughs> thank you bye bye